for the week of November 10th through November 16th. In this edition of The Chatter, we will probe the headlines at RCHS this coming week, look ahead to important upcoming events, celebrate the latest in the club scene, gab about guidance, polish off the lunch menu, and ruminate over some of school trivia with the common question of the week. <laughs> their monthly character education lesson in the auditorium during Comet time and the seniors will take their turn on Thursday, November 13th. Tomorrow, November 11th, we will not have school due to Veterans Day. On Wednesday, November 12th, the teachers will have a staff meeting after school in the chorus room from 3 o'clock to 4 o'clock. And now let's look ahead with Katie Castanero. Katie Castanero, and let's look ahead to some upcoming events for Reed Custer High School. Justin's will be here on Monday, November 17th to meet with the seniors in assembly during comment time to discuss their grad graduation caps and gowns and to deliver any class rings during the lunches that have been ordered. The Justin's rep will be back on Wednesday, November 19th and the 25th to collect any senior cap and gown orders. The Reed Custer School Board will have their monthly meeting on Wednesday, November 19th at 6.30 p.m in the Stephen Hanks Administrative Center. NHS interviews will take place on Thursday, November 20th between first period and comment time. We have no school on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, November 26th, 27th, and 28th due to Thanksgiving break. Have a great week, everybody. <laughs> I'm Megan Lord, and let's look at what some of the clubs and organizations are up to. In music news, the Pep Band submitted an audition CD in December of 2013 and was selected to perform for the IHSA State Volleyball Tournament at Redbird Stadium Friday, November 14th. The Pep Band will be playing in four games throughout the day. Congratulations to the RCHS Pep Band for making it to the state finals. The music department is also excited to announce the Professional Steel Pan Percussion Ensemble, Callaloo, will be in concert at the RCHS Auditorium on Sunday, November 16th. It will be a concert and clinic on the world's percussion instruments. The Kalaloo experience oral, visual, and projection, <laughs> dancing, and educational. Our own percussionists will be performing on the stage with Kalaloo, as well as our RCHS cheerleaders. If you have any questions, please contact Ms. Dennis. Tickets are $10 each. You can buy tickets in advance or at the door. The Calculating Commons have started practicing in preparation for the 2014-2015 season. Their first meet is on November 19th at Feature. Good luck this season, we're counting on you. This Wednesday, November 12th, the film club will be showing the classical Marx Brothers movie, Doug The movie will begin at 4.15 in the auditorium. After the movie, there will be a short discussion about the film. Check out this movie trailer. See you at the theater tonight. I'll hold your seat till you get there. After you get there, you're on your own. Hello? Hello, yes? No, he's not in yet. All right, well, goodbye. That was for you again. I wonder whatever became of me. I should have been back here a long time ago. They got guns, we got guns, all got guns, got guns. <laughs>
this episode of Comment Clubs and Activities. See you next week. Comment and keep on clubbing. Hi, this is Christian Faber, and let's check in on the latest guidance gossip. On Thursday, November 13th, Illinois State University will be visiting RCHS during the lunches in the school commons. Progress grades will be printed and sent home with students after Monday, November 17th. Here we have the guidance blog, which can be accessed by going to high school, scrolling down to guidance blog, and then coming up here and clicking on RCHS guidance blog, where this is brought up. The scholarship that we will be speaking of today will be the Will South Cook Soil and Water Conservation District. The Will South Cook Soil and Water Conservation District offers conservation education scholarships. Applicants must live within the boundaries of the district, Will or South Cook County, and plan to attend college in the fall of 2015, as well as plan to major or study agriculture, environmental science, horticulture, wildlife, soil, or other natural resources. Application deadlines are February 1st of 2015. Don't forget to check out the Guidance Counselor's blog for important information about scholarships, testing, and other upcoming important events. Hi, this is Carson Anderson. And Austin Willis. This is your sports schedule for the week. Tonight, the boys basketball and wrestling teams will begin practicing for the 2014-15 seasons, and girls basketball will have Meet the Comets tonight at 6 o'clock. Thursday will be the Fall Sports Awards at 6.30 in the auditorium. All winter sports pictures will be taken on Saturday, November 22nd. Go, Go Comets! Hello, Reed Custer. Here's your comic question of the week. How many rooms in the high school proper are used for student learning and for staff educational purposes? Do not include washrooms and do not include anything in the field house, like your weight room and your workout room or the field house proper. Answer will come after this week's menu. Hi, I'm Jessica Boyd, and on November 10th, Jessica Boyd uh, we are having chicken nuggets and that oh so savory Mexican rice. And you guessed it, pizza. Hey, what do you call a sleeping pizza? A uh, pizza. Hi, I'm Zach Vigley, and on Wednesday, November 12th, we'll have hot dog with fixings and pizza. Hello, I'm Bryce Lemons, and on Thursday, the 13th, we'll have Italian wrap soup uh, with barbecue rib on a bun. I'm Charles Wagner, on Friday, November 14th, we'll have popular chicken and pizza. The answer is C, 52. That will do it for this episode of the Chatter Newscast. Enjoy the week comments and thanks for watching.